we're in the kitchen and we're cooking burgers today. Lean burgers. It doesn't matter if you grill them for the summer season or just make them in the kitchen like I am. Join us. First, you want to start with two pounds of ground turkey or chicken, something lean. This is about 93% fat free here. I'm going to throw in a full cup of all different kind of peppers, nutrients, vitamins, color into my burgers. It doesn't matter if it's spinach. I've even thrown in artichokes in here. You just want to add the nutrients to the protein. And next, I'm going to grab my ranch dressing for half of a cup. So in the bowl, I have two pounds of ground turkey. You can also use ground chicken or even a, a, a lean beef if you choose. A full cup of all different colored peppers. And then I added some fat-free ranch dressing. And this is gonna give me all the flavor that I need. Seasoned it up really, really good. It's only 50 calories for two tablespoons and I've used half a cup in there. So I just put that in there. If you tend to use too much dressing and your mixture becomes a little too liquidy um, or just not as dense as you need it to then and you're grilling then you can actually put these burgers on top of some aluminum foil and grill those up and it'll be just fine so as you can see I'm mixing these up you don't want to mix it too much I am the type of person I am not getting my hands dirty do not judge me but I'm doing this with a spoon and the thing about meat is, you, a ground meat that is, you don't want to mix it too much because then it'll be really, really dense. Have you ever bitten to one of those frozen burgers and it was just, it tastes like cardboard? You want to really kind of treat it delicately, just sort of mix it around and fold it um, versus, you know, chop up every little strand and really get that going. So as you can see, I don't need an egg. I just used my fat-free ranch dressing. You can use any type of dressing that you want. They've got a, a amazing assortment nowadays with buffalo ranch and, you know, blue cheese if you choose. Um, my peppers for my nutrients. And again, you can put some spinach in there um, or any type of vegetable that you'd like. Well, I will get my hands dirty for this one. Shape those up. Place it onto the skillet. The skillet is uh, it has about two tablespoons of olive oil in there. And I know what a lot of you are wondering, are these veggies, these peppers, going to really, really um, soften up inside the burger? They will soften up. You want to keep your heat on medium. Of course, if you're grilling, you can't control that as much. But you get the idea. You don't want a super hot skillet so that the, the veggies can really, really cook uh, inside the meat. And that's it. That is it, ladies and gentlemen. Pile those up. They're going to be flavorful, super flavorful, and uh, moist, as well as they're going to be nutrient rich. So, burgers, 360 style. But there we have it. We've got burgers. They've got nutrition. You can add you again your spinach or whatever you choose. Broccoli, even. I've done it before. It's really good. If you truly are concerned about them being a little bit more dense and not softening, go ahead and put the lid over the meat while it's cooking. Uh, but in general, three ingredients, and we've got a fantastic meal for lunchtime. And you can again put them on the grill. Check it out. If you taste it, you want a little bit more seasoning, go ahead and put some cayenne on there. You know, of course, you have some Mediterranean sea salt, right? Okay, so I got my burgers and plated up, and I'm gonna add some more veggies on top. Of course, fruit for the tomatoes. Um, but then we didn't even put any onion in there because I wanted to add some grilled onions right on top. Mmm, how does that sound, right? So everybody gets a tomato. If you don't like tomatoes, don't use tomatoes, whatever you want. Put my grilled onions on top. A little bit of lettuce. And we're all set. Thank you guys for joining us. Stay strong, stay confident, and stay committed. Remember, make your day a mindful practice and keep this going. Follow us on 
Instagram and Facebook. Facebook is 360 Mind, Body, and Soul. Instagram, 360 MBS. And the website is 360MBS, like mindbodysoul.com. Have fun. Please. Oh, my God. <laughs> that doesn't have much to do with cooking. All right?